Hi, I am Henry, and this is the first of three 2.1 Bluetooth speaker builds. This first build is for my 12 year old nephew. Uh, the MDF parts uh, were all CNC cut, and the birch plywood parts I cut myself from off cuts I had in the workshop. Uh, the assembly is pretty simple, it's just a plain box. You can see here that these quick grip clamps are pretty useless. Uh, I resorted to uh, using the nail gun instead. Uh, I ended up buying some better F style clamps uh, later on. Uh, here I'm just making sure that uh, all the gaps inside the box are filled with glue. Um, uh, the box gets cladded with uh, bamboo plywood about five more thick. Um, I didn't document the entire cladding process. Here's the result after finishing the bamboo cladding and attaching the aluminium and the MDF stand. In this phase I'm doing some of the detail work. Uh, the speaker grill gets covered in acoustically transparent black cloth. A contact adhesive is applied to the sides of the MDF grill. Uh, it's left to dry uh, until it just gets tacky to the touch. You can then uh, stretch the cloth over um, and then just trim it off afterwards. That's a finished grill and it fits uh, snug and perfectly. Now we're getting to the electronic parts of the board. Uh, these speaker drivers were salvaged from an old sound system. But the quality seems very good and it fits my needs for this build very well. I'm also adding some damping material into the enclosure. This helps prevent the buildup of standing waves inside the cabinet.
This little uh, amplifier is a TPA3116 2.1 channel amp module with uh, Bluetooth 4.0. It packs a real punch for its size. It delivers uh, 50 watts at 4 ohms into two channels and 100 watts at 4 ohms into one channel. Uh, I'll put a link to, uh, to it in the description uh, with details on where you can purchase it. Uh, here I'm just attaching uh, the power cables uh, that's going to go from the power inlet to the power supply. Uh, it's a manual 24 volt 4 amp switch mode PSU. Now it's just a matter of uh, connecting all the wires up. Uh, we're collecting, uh, connecting the left and right uh, speaker and also the subwoofer, uh, closing the back and then now uh, we're almost ready to test it. Well, I'm very happy with how this build came out. Um, as you can hear, it sounds really amazing. Uh, the bass is really nice and deep, and you get really clear highs. Um, so, I really hope you enjoyed this project um, and uh, look out for the next one. Thank you all for watching, please remember to subscribe to my channel and like this video. My name is Henry, until next time, adios.